Hey guys, it's me Jake from Jakeman21642. Today I bring you a video of this 2010 Ford Mustang GT. As you can see, this one has a Kona blue exterior. Coming along the back of the vehicle, this one is riding on General Ultimax tires. As you can see along here, they are very nice new shaped tires. There are 235, 50 R18s, so your 18 inch retro alloy wheels with your rear disc brakes. Coming along the back of the vehicle, you can see your dual exhaust, very nice sound to it. And your GT badge right here. The Kona Blue looks absolutely excellent on this car. Coming along down here, you can see your little stripe with your GT badge right there and right there. Coming along the front, this one does have halogen headlights along with your fog lights inside the grill. Go ahead, start it up. You do get your standard Ford key fob. And this one does come with a beige leather interior with your Mustang emblem down here. Go ahead, start it up. You do have a partial power driver's seat right here. Very nice sound. And coming inside of this Mustang, you do have a very nice leather wrapped steering wheel. Very nice and tight hydraulic power steering. Coming along here, you do have your cruise control, your audio system, and sync controls. Up here, everything fits together very nicely. Down here, you do have your soft padded leather along the door and your padded armrest down here. You do have automatic windows in the front. And over here, you have your info set up and reset along with your headlights and fog lights over here. Coming along the center, you can see your gauges, your speedometer, tachometer, and all your other auxiliary gauges in the middle. Coming along the top, you have a very nice padded dashboard along with around here. The padding follows through and your brushed aluminum along the top. You have your 12 volt outlet in the center. Along with down here, you have your Shaker 500 audio system, 500 watts. It is AM, FM, Sirius, CD, and auxiliary. Very nice system, very easy to use too. And it sounds excellent. Down here, you have your traction control on and off, your hazards, and your trunk release. This vehicle does come equipped with a five-speed automatic. Selectable right, right here. You can turn your overdrive on and off. Down here, you do have your single zone climate control. Very nice and simple to use. Coming right here, you do have your two cup holders, and they are lit. As you can see, it kind of does pulse. You can change the color of the interior illumination also. It's a very nice, easy to use system inside of here you have your usb and auxiliary for your sink and right here you have a power outlet and right here you have your leather stitch d brake up here you have your auto dimming your view mirror your interior lighting and right here you have your mirror and overall it's a very nicely well put together interior it's a soft touch on the headliner seats are very nicely bolstered you have your perforated leather in the middle and it's very very nice quality leather your headrests, as I mentioned, everything holds you in very well. So we'll go ahead, put the automatic driver's side window down, unlock all the doors, and we'll pop the trunk. Pop the hood right here. Coming along to the back of the vehicle, go ahead and pop the trunk right here. The vehicle actually has a very nice amount of trunk space for a muscle car. As you can see, you do get hinges, which don't interfere with your cargo. Like I said, very nice amount of room. And inside of here, you have your spare tire. And it is lined up here. Coming along to the passenger side, go ahead and step into the back seat pull forward right here and then you can move the seat forward for ease of entrance you have your rear footwell lighting right here also and for what it is the back seat of the Mustang honestly is not that bad of a place to be the seat can come back a little further and your knees do touch but there's place for them to go in without interfering with the front passenger I have personally been on a road trip a very long road trip in the back of one of these and it's not that bad seats are very nice and comfortable bucket seats as I mentioned, legroom is the only thing, but it's actually, since it's a bucket seat, your thighs are very nice and comfortable back here. 
of your armrest and a little window right here. And as I mentioned, you do have your footwell lighting on the sides. And entry and exit are very nice and easy. Go ahead and put this back. Coming up here, inside the glove box, this one does come with your original sink owner's manual. And coming up underneath the hood of this vehicle, you can see your halogen headlights and fog lights. Go ahead and pop the hood right here. This vehicle does have a 4.6 liter V8 engine. Your cold air induction over here. And 2010 was the only year you could get this engine on this body style of the Mustang. Just a little interesting fact. So we'll go ahead, step inside and give this one a rev, and then cut it off. Very nice sound this thing makes. We'll go ahead, put the automatic driver's side window back up, and cut the vehicle off. Little chime, letting you know to take the key. And we'll go ahead, put the headlights back in automatic mode. And as always, this vehicle is for sale at Volvo of Richmond, here in Richmond, Virginia. If you are interested in this vehicle, please let Volvo of Richmond know you saw this video.